and and it's okay. yes, well, okay, yeah. big nose. But now I'm getting excited now, guys, because it's now time for <laughs> Spuds not, quiz. No, it's go for it, Harry. No, no, no. It's Spud Harry. Pull, that. Pull, that. Pull the plug on that, Harry. Harry. Spud, you've had your time in the sun, son. You We've sit, got tweets. Sit yourself down, Spuddy. You're a lifeline, and you've oh, always got to know your role. You're a good lifeline operator. I'm not sure about the quiz. I'm taking over. Howie's here. Yes. Sure. You, well, I've only got two. Harry, you want to be a lifeline. Harry's not a lifeline. So well, I've only got Crawford two. said he was coming, well, but he's not he? here yet. Well, I think he's over in that super box. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> his eyes back in his head. Here we go. You know what you got to do? Answer question 10 correctly. You get yourself a brand new Samsung Galaxy tablet to enjoy Herald Sun Super Footy Live HQ at the game or on the couch with live Supercoach scores, stats plus exclusive AFL news and opinion. Haven't done this for a while, for well over a month, mm. so I'm excited. Justin's going to kick us off. How are you, Justin? Good boys, yourself? Very, very nicely. We're going to keep moving because we're going to get uh, we're going to get through this pretty quickly. Which 2008 Premiership player for Hawthorne recently had his Premiership medallion stolen? Uh, Brent Grewer. Yeah, hasn't been a good uh, couple mm. of days, has it, for old Dagui? He's also out for, we think, the season anyway with that hamstring injury. Question two. Tom Hawkins played his 100th game today. In what year did he make his debut? Oh, 2000 and... Seven. Oh, 2007. Mm. Yep. Okay, we'll pay that. Question three. Get around him! <laughs> that sound always means you have a lifeline. So if you're struggling, you can call on the services of Howie, who's mm. um, been a good lifeline operator, it has to be said, since uh, making his debut this year, and Spud, who's the best cheat I know. So uh, <laughs> let's go. Which club has used the least number of players this year with 31? That's a tough one. I'll have to um, take a lifeline and I'll uh, go with Spud Regis. Oh, he's George Bird Howie. Gee, thanks, Justin. And I'm watching... Howie's normally very good at these too, but Sydney normally have... This is what I love. He, he, he tries to make it like he's thinking it through. I know he's rung Chua through the week. God. I haven't rung Chua through the week, but I know that Sydney go normally the have uh, the least amount of injuries in their premiership year and their grand final year, so I'm, I'm just going to, I don't know, but I'll go for Sydney. Oh, he's going for Sydney, Justin, you can go with it or you can go with your own. I'll have to go with, I'll have to go with Sydney as well. Well, of course you would, because he either did that or he, he actually handed me the sheet today, so I don't know how long he's had it. <laughs> 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 Question <laughs> four. Uh, that's a good start. I've got Greg, Chris, Charles, Rod, Dave, Evan, Gary, Jenny, Sarah and Michelle on the line waiting their turn. How many best and fairest did Paul Kelly win at Sydney, Justin? Four. Big fun? Oh, I thought he said or. Four is correct. Uh, you're going beautifully. The others are just uh, sitting in the wings. Question five. Get around him! Where is Joe, mate? He's gone to the ferry. Uh, you've yeah. only got Howie. When I say only. He ignored, me. He ignored <laughs> me first time too, guys. I know. When I say only, I mean he's the <laughs> last one standing. Simon Minton Connell. Oh, the hyphen. Played with four clubs. Can you name them? Carlton, Woodsgray. What about Howie? What about Howie sitting here? <laughs> Stuff him. Well, I'll go. I, I can just. I can just do the the dogs and Carlton, Sydney, and Hawthorne. Howie <laughs> sits in the wings. <laughs> Not even made it out to the crease to open his innings at this stage. <laughs> Very nicely done, though, Justin. You are only five questions away from taking the prize. I don't think we've had anyone go all the way through on question Today's one. Today's not the day, Gary, no, for Justin. it's not happening. I've never seen it happen. He's got a head wobble about him, <laughs> and I sense there's a leveller just around right. the corner. If there's not, she was in a lot of trouble. <laughs> How many times has Matthew Scarlett been selected as an All-Australian, Justin? Um, more than uh, tick, 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 tick. Got an five. answer? Five? Oh, no. There it is, bud. <laughs> <laughs> hey, stay on the line, Justin. I'm going to give you a $100 IGA liquor open uh, line voucher just uh, for getting through the first five questions. A fair effort. Uh, let's go to Greg. How's things, Greg? Very good, thank you. Great. Well, you've only got five to go, mate, and that Samsung Galaxy tablet, the best prize in footy, is heading your way. Matty Scarlett, all Australian, how many times? Uh, six. Well, well, nicely done, nicely done. In today's Triple M pregame, it, ha it was discussed 
which Triple M team member has been nominated for the Elf Brown Media Award? <laughs> uh, that would be Jason Dunstall. Who nominated him for a bonus? Uh, Danny, uh, backed <laughs> by a number of the other members of the team. Ah, well, you're a lo- I like it, Greg, because you've listened all day, so you're a chance. This is... Uh, what are you looking at? No, no, just a couple of um- umpires just oh, yeah. stretching down. Question eight. <laughs> You know, when I say you've only got Howie, how is your lifeline? Can you name two of the three clubs who haven't lost a game by more than 50 points this year? Ooh, um, I'll, I'll use Howie. Ooh, <laughs> uh, uh, ask the question again, please, Gary. <laughs> what? You've lost a bit of concentration. Um, the umpires. Can you name two of the three clubs who haven't lost a game by more than 50 points this year? Oh, I wouldn't have thought the Swans would have got rolled by more than 50 at any stage this year. Has Greg called on you as a lifeline? He uh, has. Well, you've given There's one. one for you, Greg. What, Don't what's stop your looking se- at snorkel. What's your get... second? Uh, I reckon Sydney hasn't lost by more than 50. What do you reckon, Greg? Give me one more. Yeah, I reckon Sydney. I know the Tigers have had a lot of close games, but that would be a real smoky, wouldn't it? No, I reckon I reckon you're right. I reckon uh, they got rolled early and then under 22 points. I reckon that's the answer. That's what I'd go with, Griggles. Yeah, I reckon we'll um, we'll go with that and see how we go. Whoa! Oh, Howie! See that other bloke? Howie, he should have gone for you. He should, but he's at home now. He's Out, done, it up. finished. <laughs> he's Justin. Just, he's got his $100 IJ in the voucher. He's off. Quest, uh, two to go, Greg. I've still got a big queue behind you waiting to get in, so good luck. To date, Brett Ratton's win-loss record as coach of Carlton is, and I'll give you four options, A, 50%, D, uh, B, 53%, C seventy four or D forty eight percent. B fifty three. Nuts. I'll debate this after it, but I'll well, don't debate with me. Debate with no, no. Chewy. But I'll we'll just get to the correct answer no, first. No, I need if you got a problem with that. Well, his so first six. Still there, uh, sorry, Greg. So his first six games, yeah. he was caretaker coach. That's right. So. To me, that doesn't go in it. Did you put them in, two man, or not? His first six, six games as caretaker it's coach. Document in the AFL media guide. Because He's still coach, Gaz, though. yeah, I know. But contractually wise, he was announced coach at the end of that year, and he's fifty three percent point eight, fifty three point eight. Your penalty. I take your protest under advisement, but I'm ruling with Chua. But I, I am officially right. I know he coached <laughs> those six games. No, but you're not. Well, he wasn't really well, the coach. He's a anyway, caretaker who coach. Who was coaching him? He was caretaker coach. So you two Asterix. can argue it later. Sorry about that, Chris. You've come in at the death knock here, mate. Can you uh, steal the Samsung Galaxy tablet? Brett Ratton's win loss record was it fifty percent, fifty three percent, seventy four percent, or forty eight percent? I'd say fifty, mate. How's your day been, Chris O? Yeah, not too bad. Pretty laid back. What have you been doing? Oh, listening to the call and cleaning up me mess of a garage. Here it is. Uh, you, would you like a Samsung Galaxy tablet, uh, Chris? Oh, I'd love one, Gary. You know what it is? No idea. <laughs> <laughs> it's like an iPad, but better, mate. So you could put that in the garage and away you go. You could look up anything you like. So here we are. This is it. You get this right, it's yours. How many po- uh, times did Gary Ablett Sr.? Kick 14 goals in a match? It's a tough question from Chua. Oh, I'll say three. Oh, unbelievable, Chris. Unbelievable. Are you excited? I am, mate. Is that right? That's right. That's one of the great guesses of all time. Yeah, step in the dark. Thanks, boys. The excitement of uh, our winner there well, is unbelievable. I think his heart rate went from 51 to 51.8. I think he's one of those laid-back characters. That's funny. But I, I noticed just the uh, the callers. I When I did it for a few weeks, I got a lot more female callers. You didn't get one. What's the reasoning for that? Well, there would be no reason other than that they just uh, haven't run because <laughs> you're suggesting that you're the heart. No, problem. I'm not.